with these leaders. External Affairs Minister Sushma Suraj on Wednesday held bilateral meetings with African Foreign Ministers on the sidelines of the ongoing Third India-Africa Forum Summit. The day started with a bilateral meet with the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Sierra Leone. Sierra Leone thanked India for its assistance in the fight against Ebola. It was followed by a bilateral meet with the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Congo. India gave assurance for setting up of a cement plant in the country. Then came bilateral with the Foreign Minister of the Republic of Niger. Niger briefed India about the threat of Boko Haram to the region. It also requested India's assistance for capacity building in defence sector. It was followed by bilateral meet with the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Burkina Faso. The country talked about a future roadmap on the Joint Commission meet. And when Nabibia's their Deputy Prime Minister met with External Affairs Minister, they talked about supply of uranium to India. Namibia is the fourth largest producer of uranium in the world. Togo's Foreign Minister spoke about capacity building. India raised the issue of detention of five Indian nationals in the country since July 2010 and a possible presidential pardon was also discussed. Sautome and Principe asked for India's assistance in development of SME sector. The country also asked India to establish a centre of excellence in teaching English language in the country. Liberia was all praised for India's all-women CRPF contingent which has inspired many women in the country. Senegal asked for India's assistance in development of a national railways network. Guinea's foreign minister talked about capacity building. Sudan, a country known for natural resources like oil, called for Indian investment in development of the sector in the country. Sushma Swaraj also met with the chairperson of the African Union Commission. India thanked the African Union Commission for making the third India-Africa Forum Summit a success. These bilaterals lead the way for the big leader summit on Thursday where 54 African leaders will join with Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Also two special invitees, UAE and Singapore, countries that can become India's highway to the African continent. With camera person AK, Siddhan Subbal, TD News, New Delhi. Well, apart from the India-Africa Forum,